Alright YouTube, welcome back to another video of Jurassic World Live. So now today, I do want to talk about something. I should have made the video from earlier longer because then I wouldn't be uploading a second video of it today. But So here's the thing. Now, I'm going to put the image up on screen right now. So it kind of shows, you know, water background with a, I'm going to say a Mosasaur tail. And it says, prepare to take flight. I don't know what it actually says because I'm not looking at it at the moment. I'm just playing the game. But now, if there is going to be an aquatic update, I think this may be fake, the picture. Um, it probably is, if it says prepare to take flight. But, you know, I do want to theorize what it would be like in this game if you were to have aquatics in this game now. I feel like if they were to make them swim on land, it would look really stupid if they were just, like, floating. I think if they were to have them in the ponds, because I have a pond in my backyard. I think it's on the map here. I got to check in a second. I think if they were to have ponds or the beach or rivers, anything like that. Yeah, there's no ponds yet. So I have a feeling if they were to make an aquatic update, they could possibly make it to where the ponds would be, where the ponds are supposed to be, like in our backyards or whatever. Or maybe the Hudson River in New York, you can go there, you find aquatics. That'd be a good idea. Um, Now, with this, I don't know. I feel like it'd be weird. Or maybe they have like an aquatic map, possibly. You could switch maps. Like this is the main map, the land map. Maybe they would have it to where there's like another icon, you click that, and then it takes you to a whole water map where everything is just covered in water. Um, there's no houses. They have like maybe some marines where the houses would be. Like Jurassic Park Builder where you would uh, switch to another map. I don't know. I just feel like there could be uh, some good ideas in this. I don't know. It's probably a fake image. I did just want to make the video on it because I could probably get some views from it. Um, but, you know, I mean, why not? Gotta grow the channel. And this is a dinosaur I've never seen before. I think this is actually new. I don't want to say it is new, but I feel like it is. I don't know. I've never seen them. But an aquatic update would be extremely good. I feel like it would be way too early because when we first got Jurassic World, the game, um, they didn't have hybrids out right away, and then they released that, and then they released the uh, Mosasaur. So I feel like aquatic shouldn't be coming out just yet. Maybe, like, I don't know. I, just, I don't know. It would feel weird with this. I mean, it would be a great thing to have, like... You know, if they had a Xenozoic update, that would be another cool feature. Um, but yeah, how three rounds. We can do this. We got this. But, yeah, is there a camera on this app? I don't know. I could possibly show. Because I do have a pond in my backyard. And there's some geese out there. I don't know. I'll show it after I'm done with this round. Let's throw an Indominus. Oh, my fingers. Oh. Choose a creature. I just did. Are you calling me a liar? All right, but now I feel like how the aquatics would appear on the map if this was an actual thing. Possibly they would either be halfway in the water to where if it was a mosasaur, chronosaur, marine reptiles, things like that. They'd possibly have it to where their heads are bobbing out of the water along with the backs. Like possibly they make it look like a crocodile. I don't know. Or they would just have them floating above a pond or something like how we have normal dinosaurs standing on the map. Um... I prefer the one where they're kind of just like bobbing in the water, where their head and back is just sticking out. But for Megalodons, they could have them swimming around the pond, like how they have the pterosaurs kind of fly around the uh, supply drops, which would be pretty good. And I should probably pay attention to the game and, you know. All right, got two more rounds. So what I'm going to do is real quickly, I'm going to exit out. I go to camera. And yeah, I do have the image down there. You can see it. It'll be at the thumbnail and it'll throw it in. But look, I have a pond. Pretty nice pond. I know. I have a great backyard. I love it. Got the gate. Go back there. Go fishing, even though my fishing rod has been broken. So yeah, let's go back in the game and continue the battle because it's great, you know? Ooh, post a metrodon. post -o metrodon. I don't know. The aquatic update would be great for this. I mean, I feel like it'd be too soon, though. You know what I mean? I think this only, what, came out what well it's been a year has it wait has it been out for a full year because it was out since last summer it came out last summer i think the uh second month of summer in florida we have a different summer it starts sooner than what we have in new york so if that's i don't know i don't know how it works on the west coast florida gets their summer first then new york gets it during their second month and then a month after and then you know every summer's two months so you know i think it should be three months but it's not by now Oh, we didn't kill him. Okie dokie. We got to kill this thing. Boom. I'll go for a smaller attack. But, um, so what would be cool is if they did have the uh, Mosasaurus, they could possibly, I I'm kind of leaning towards an aquatic map in a way. I don't know. I feel like it'd be hard. I feel like what they would do is they would kind of ruin it by making it to where all the dinosaurs are on the same map. Now, 
I don't know. That like, I'm not really sure on what to think about it. They better not ruin it. If they ruin this aquatic thing, I know it's probably not coming out. But if they do eventually do it at some point and they ruin it, I will be very angry. You know. All right, let's kill this guy. Come on. Ooh. Oh, it's a lot of damage. It is level 15, though. I think it's a common. Oh, okay. We'll go for a... We'll go for this, hopefully. Oh. Ooh, almost killed us. Wow, okay. But, yeah. Hmm. Aquatic update. I like the aquatics. They're pretty good, I guess. I don't know. I wonder how they would do it, though. Would they, like... No, they wouldn't throw, like, the crocodiles into the, uh, you know, water. I don't know. They could change it where they can make, like, crocodiles and stuff spawn in the water in the game, which would be a pretty cool little thing. I would actually like that a lot. Ooh, let's throw in Coolosaurus, you, you, and you. Battle. All these neighbors, they're all outside in the back. The only thing is with the pond back here, the neighbors go fishing all the time. And we have, a, like, a glass door downstairs, which it gets annoying because... Well, today they're not really back there. They're in their own yards, but like sometimes they're always back there. Like, jeez, they're just back there all the time. It's like, I mean, they have a right to be back there too. Their yards connect to it as well. But like, you know, it's every day. Jeez, you know what I mean? It's ridiculous. Let's go for that. I think that would be good. Ooh, oh, is he gonna kill us? Oh, oh, big hit. Okay. All right, good. We gotta get the first kill to be able to win this. All right. Um, I've also, I, um, I've been playing, uh, School of Dragons as well. Now, I don't know how long I'm gonna play it because it's, like, requesting me to, uh, you know, get some form of an expansion for the dragon carrier thing. Not carrier, like, oh, we dodged it, wow. And boom. <laughs> but, yeah, it's, the game is just, you know, it's requiring me to spend a lot of money. Yeah, got off topic. It's, oh, we're nearing the end of the video, so, you know. I might as well talk about something else. We kind of covered the aquatic update and what I would know about it if I could, uh, if I knew. I don't know. Don't know much. <clears throat> it's probably not even real yet. I doubt they're probably working on it, but they're probably going to release it maybe next year. I don't know. It would be cool to get some aquatics released, though. You know? Oop. Yeah, we killed it. Good. We got the second kill. One more kill. Hopefully, we get some more coin. I got to start saving up the coin again. And, yeah. Hmm. You know what I did think? I did think, like, I wish they made really regionals in this game. Like, I know Pokemon Go has it, and I know this game would do good with it. Like, say, for example, um, Pacific dinosaurs or prehistoric things can be in, like, one area of the world where you would have to go get them, where they were actually discovered in real life. Because I'm thinking with Xenozoics, um, they could possibly do that. Now, I know for a fact there is a prehistoric sloth that lives somewhere in South America, which would be a cool regional. Oh, he can kill us if... Oh, <gasps> Don't kill us, please. Ooh. Okay, not that bad, but still. We can probably... Oh, good, we killed it. Good. We could have survived another one of those hits, but... Yeah, let's see what we get, and then I'll end off the video here. All right. Tap to continue. I'm surprised this game isn't more popular than Jurassic World the game. I mean, I don't think... I don't know what they're... Oh, 3,000, not bad. Wow, 1,445. Another 1,000. 200, not bad. And 283, good. All right, so if you guys like this video, click like, subscribe. I'll see you guys later, and uh, bye.